You ready, girl? Let's eat. Oh, uh, that, which reminds me, Snickers and Twix, or Snickledoodle and Twix. Oh, no. Twix. S I don't, I can't reply to your comments for some reason on YouTube. It's Snickers. Snickers. I cannot reply, I tried to reply to your comment today and the other day, and I kept on forgetting to tell Snickerdoodle. you that. Snickerdoodle. <laughs> I cannot reply to your comment. Um, what, I don't it's even Snickers. Remember. I know exactly what you're talking about. Yeah, I couldn't... Re for some reason, I could not um, reply to your comment. I don't know why. <laughs> Cheyenne, what did you eat for dinner tonight? Did you eat anything good? Pizza, maybe? Oh, <coughs> oh I forgot my balsamic. Get oh, your shit. balsamic. I'm going to start cutting, okay? Oh. Uh, do you have something under here? You do. I was wondering why the pizza's so high. I'm gonna give you guys a close up in just a second. Live, laugh, love. Who has that in their house? I get, if you don't have a uh, heating tray holder that says live, laugh, love, I bet you have like a mitt or a pitcher or something. I'm good. How are you? Ordered a wing platter from TJF Fridays. I'll be even better when that gets here. You're at Friday's right now? Who's at Friday's? Uh, Cheyenne. She ordered a wing platter. Nice. Hecky, you know what? You do a much better job. You want to cut this so I don't butcher it? Um, I'm going to butcher it too. Okay, then, I'll, then I might as well butcher it. Only because the whole middle of the pizza I had to reconstruct to put it on the pan. Here's the problem. When you get an extra cheese pizza... It, it's it, it's soggy when you first get it, and we like hey, our. Chooch. I don't know what that means in Spanish. I have no clue. What? Whatever he just said. Oh, Chooch said, "Hi, Chooch." <laughs> um, whenever you get an extra cheese pie and you let it sit, it gets soggy and it sticks to the 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 the, the, the paper, the, the paper parchment. underneath, the parchment paper. So when you're ripping it apart, the cheese sticks to it, and then you get it on there. Last weekend, last Saturday, I should say. I um I didn't cook the pizza long enough, so tonight was number one top priority to make sure the pizza was freaking cooked. Uber Eats is your savior, huh, Cheyenne? Good for you. TGF Fridays loves Uber Eats. Uber Eats, I swear to God, like you can get anything on Uber Eats. Okay, go ahead. I'm just gonna finish my beer. I'm gonna pull this big ass Maybe I won't finish my beer. Maybe I'll just keep it to the side and go from there. All right, I'm gonna go with. I'm going with this big ass pepperoni slicer in here. Yeah, we did, um, we didn't get, we didn't order pepperoni. We have pepperoni. No, we have pepperoni. We just added it. And Kaki's like, do you want to do pepperoni? I'm like, yeah, I guess. I don't care. Do half of it. At least I still like the regular, the regular cheese. Hi, Jimmy Jam. Oh, Chooch is talking Spanish. Chooch, do you actually speak Spanish or you just like, you know? You... No. I don't he think... definitely speaks Spanish. Oh, he does? I think you should make a video of you talking Spanish, like saying, I called you back. Oh, Chooch, I'm guessing you're talking to Unless he's talking to you, did you call Jimmy Jam and. You... No. He said, What's up, you two sexy fucks? Yeah, no, he's. And then he I said, called I... you back. I think he was talking to Chooch. Jimmy never called me. I'm not here right now. I'm a zombie. Okay. Fair enough. I get it. I get it. Um, well, I just want to say this, Chooch. I hope everything is good. I hope the baby's doing good, sleeping through the night. And uh, you guys are fucking are a happy, happy, happy family. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. As, I'll be happy in like three hours when I get up to eat my fucking Entenmann's holiday cookie collection. I'll be happy when I clock out of work tomorrow. <laughs> Because I won't have to be back for at least two days. Because now, guys, when I go to work, I hate it. I'm by myself most of the time. What changed? What changed that you're by yourself now? <clears throat> well, the prepared foods is now closed. There's no more prepared foods. There's so no more you, fried chicken. Right. There's so no, what do you do now? You well, still cutting fruit? I'm still cutting fruit and vegetables, but... I don't have anybody to talk to. Who did you have to talk to? I had Sue, I had Kevin, Where I had are they Steve. Now? Well, Sue is now in Delhi, and I only work with her on Fridays. Steve has been in Cinema Riches because they're opening up that store. Big Steve? No. Where'd he the, be at? Oh, he's in, like, 
East Islip or West Islip somewhere. But no, Steve, the person that we got Isabella's um, power wheel from. Oh yes, Steve. Hello, Steve. Yes. He's now in Cinema Riches um, getting that store ready for grand opening, which is next Wednesday. Mm. So, and then Kevin called out the past two days. Hi, Chris. But normally he's on register, so I don't even really get to see Kevin either. So it's just, it's fucking boring for me. All well, the people I worked with Kevin that I actually like. Kevin does not seem like, like a register guy. I saw Tyler today. And um, <laughs> I didn't even. I saw Tyler yesterday, briefly. Well, didn't even get to talk to him about him calling you like well, Michael. Well, you wouldn't have to because it happened last night. So no, no. Would... I mean, I saw him. Well, here, no, I saw him today, but I didn't. They had some chick that choice. looks like my cousin Danielle uh, on the register today, and that tonight looks she looks like my cousin Danielle, and um, I don't, I she looks like a young, young version of my cousin. And I'm, I'm, I'm not saying my cousin looks old. I'm just saying she looks like she's like 17, 18 years old, and she was swamped. She had like 15 people on the register, and I'm like, really Fuck. skinny brown hair. She was not skinny, no. no. And I'm not saying Danielle's overweight. My cousin's very beautiful. No, but, she is. She's but what out. I'm saying, but what I'm saying is like I'm waiting in line, and then I'm like, I see Tyler, and Tyler's like, I'll take you on three. <laughs> He's like, What's up, bro? Hi, Nicole. Hey, Nicole. How are you? And I was going to tell him about, hey, remember when you called me Michael last night? And I agreed and said, oh yeah, Michael's my name. My name's really not Michael. But, it got me thinking. I kind of do look like a Michael. Like, I'm, like, khaki, look at my face in, in the screen. You do don't I, look like a Michael. Man. I don't look like a Michael. Do you guys think I look like a Michael? What do you think my name, like, if you didn't know me and you didn't know my name is Jamie... And you know, Khaki's name was Khaki, or Kathy. What do you think our names, like, what do we look like? Do I look like an Andrew? Do I look like a Joe? Hey, Papa Bear. Hey, Papa Bear. Hi, Trish. I think I said hi, Trish, before, but just in case I didn't say it, I want to say hi, Trish. Check my text. Hello, Chris Snyders. Hi, Chris Snyders. Nicole agrees you look like a Michael. No. I don't think he looks like a Michael. I think I look like a Michael. I think I might legally change my name to Michael. I look like a Kevin? Fuck that. I had a manager named Kevin. Yeah, you did. He was a chubby fucking f softball player. He was nice. You look like a Jeremy. I was gonna say that. That's funny as shit. I look like a who? Jeremy. I look like a Jeremy? Jeremy? Andrew Card said that. I was gonna say that too. I'm like, you look like Jeremy. What do I look like? I think it's because I know you. Like, I don't see you... Maybe a Sarah. Okay. Maybe a Sarah. Guys, what do I look like if you didn't know my name? I already asked that question. I know, but nobody said Julie. anything. No. Julie. Julie O'Donnell. <laughs> Our daughter Isabella. If I'm not saying she looks like a Rosie O'Donnell, but she fucking sure as hell has the personality as Rosie O'Donnell. I look like a Maria. Maria, Maria might, yeah. Maria, yeah, you pass as a Maria. I take offense to that because that's the girl I work with that I don't like. Papa Bear, you know what's <laughs> funny? You do not look like a Kenny. You don't look like a Kenny. No, you don't. Jimmy Jail. Chooch looks like a Bob. I'm giving Sarah a Veronica vibes. I will take Veronica. That's a unique name. You don't really hear that name anymore. Sure you do. Veronica? I found this new porn star. Her name is Victoria Banks. She is my fucking favorite. Like, I've seen a lot of porn, right, <laughs> in my day. I've seen a lot of adult actresses. And this... You can see Maria, too. Look at my text. All right, Jimmy. Hold the fuck on. It's funny Calm how you... your pits. As my grandmother would say, calm your pits. It's funny how you associate a name with like the way they look, right? Angie? I don't know about an Angie. I would definitely say Maria, though. Here's the thing. And, and hear me out on this. It's funny how a name can totally alter what you think about what somebody would look like. For instance, if you see somebody named Abigail, 
you're gonna think of someone, Abigail. someone much older, right? Born in the fifties, maybe sixties, maybe seventies. I don't know. But let's just say, <laughs> let's just say she's fucking drop dead gorgeous. You're gonna be like, holy shit, Abigail is a hot name. This happened to me yesterday. I found this porn star on, through Twitter, and I've never been attracted to the name Victoria. I always thought hey, it. Uh, to me, Jim. I Not always me. thought it was like a just a, a bland name. And then I saw this, this, this. And at first, I thought she was a model. I just thought she was a model. Then I did some research on her. She's a fucking porn star. And I think Victoria is a sexy name, and she is my very, very, absolute <coughs> most favorite. I showed you her. Oh, is that the girl that just pops aside to make her ass jiggle? Yeah. <laughs> She's pretty hot. I'm not gonna lie. Jerk face? That was mean, Kagi. Jerk face. You call me jerk face. Is anybody else like that? Does anybody associate somebody, like a name, and then see what they look like? And I'm not trying to be like... Like, am I making sense? Like, do you ever, like, hear a name and you're, like, you're disgusted by it? Not disgusted by it, but, like, oh, that's not an attractive name. And then you see the person and they're like, oh, my God, he's a dreamboat. No. Really? I normally kind of just look at somebody and, like, hear their name, like, and I could, like, picture them as, like, a different name. See, I don't, see, I don't, I don't do that. See, I can. I think I'm going to start looking at, ca because cashiers are someone I see the most. Whether it's food related or, or whatever. See, Nicole said most people look like their name. See, I but, don't feel like I look like my name. Do I look like my name? I, I really, ever since Tyler said I look like a Michael, I feel like I, I look like a Michael. A Sean Michael? No, <laughs> not Sean. Michael. Does oh. it match the way they look? See, Papa Bear, that's the thing. Like, if I hear somebody's voice before I actually see them, I, I don't picture them. Like, I can picture them in my head, but then I'm just like, wow. Well, Papa Bear, we were shocked when we met you. Yeah, we Papa were, Bear, were big you, time. <laughs> were, you, were you expecting, you know, what you got when you met us? Well, he's obviously seen us and spoken to us, so. That's true. That's true. When well, I first no. met you, Papa Bear, I was just like, like, for some reason, I thought you were going to be like, I don't know. Like, you're like, I don't even know how to describe it. Like, I thought you were going to be like really hard and tough. And then I met you and you were like, just like this big teddy bear. Yeah, Papa Bear. <laughs> you're like this big teddy bear. No, Chooch, we're talking about names and like how you meet someone and... You usually get it like you, you think their name is is one like for instance, someone someone thought I looked like a Michael, and they tried guessing my name at the grocery store last night, and then the girl that was with him said, "Oh, you look like an Andrew." My question is, and like for you, Chooch, I think you look like a Bob. Like I think you could pass easily as a Bob. I knew a guy once. His name was Eric, but my brother's name was Eric, and he didn't look like an Eric at all. And the guy was a douche, so I called him Matt. J money, that's funny as shit. You called him Matt. Mm. Like, I'm only a dick when people piss mm -hmm. me off. I can't see you being a dick though, Pop Bear. That's the thing. I see you my bitch when people piss me off. I cannot. You have not yet. Yeah, they're good, right? Mm hmm. They are very good. Right, I'm gonna have a pepperoni. I just want to call you BFF I've been Gina. Watching too many episodes of Martin. Just want to call you Biff Gina. BFF Gina. Oh, BFF Gina. Martin. That's a good show. That's a good show, but it does not compare to the Wayne's Brothers. Mm -mm. I prefer the Wayne's Brothers over Martin. Are you a Wayne's Brothers fan, a Martin fan, or Fresh Prince of Bel Air fan? You had to pick one. We need to hang out more and watch somebody piss you off. You had to pick I one. I agree. We need to hang out more and watch somebody piss me off. <laughs> I look like an Adolf. I'm going to need you to hold me back, Baba Bear. 
You know what? If I were to legally change my name, I was thinking about this today, and this has nothing to do with my, you know, my woman crush Wednesday forever, Paris Hilton. <laughs> but I think men that have, you know, men that have their name. Uh, or know, Trevor. <laughs> fuck who? Trevor. She said you could pass as a Piper or a Trevor. A <laughs> uh, who? A Piper or a Trevor. A Piper? I'll, I'll take Piper. I can see Piper, actually. I can see Piper or Michael. Mm -hmm. Not Trevor. I can't see Piper. Why, is Piper too sexy for me to be a uh, Piper? Martin, definitely. Piper's kind of girly. Fridge tour, fridge tour. You what? You want to see our fridge? What, what our fridge looks like? Um. Right now, it's very empty. Well, yeah, we have to go food shopping, but there's still a lot of shit in there. Nah. There's a lot of chips in there, in our freezer, but... I go crazy with the chips. I knew a gay guy named Piper. Biff and Buffy. I, well, that's something you just don't hear every day. A man named Buffy. A man like named Buffy. Buffy the Vampire Slayer? Yeah. A man named Buffy that's not really Buffy. But I could be Buffy. I'm going to be Buffy one day. I'm going to bite you if you stick your arm in my face like that. It wasn't my arm, it was my elbow. I'm gonna bite it next time. I really do think I'm gonna legally change my name now. Shocker. My a Logan or a Johnny? Do I look like a Logan? It's hard Logan. because we see each other as our names. No, I have two names. See, now, I would prefer Catherine over Kathleen. No, I will never call Kathy Catherine. Unless I'm making fun of her. I love the name Catherine. <laughs> I wish that would have been my name, Catherine. If you ever hear me call you Catherine, it's because I'm fucking making fun of you. I do not like that name. I do not like that so name. So maybe me call you by your full name. Both had long hair. Not John, Johnny. Both had long hair. You look like hair. an Anthony. It's funny that you say that, Tris, because I was thinking that earlier. You know what's fu even funnier is when I was little, I wanted to, I wanted my name to be Anthony. And when I moved <laughs> to Atlanta, Georgia, I used to write letters to my mom when my mom was pregnant with my baby brother. And um, I would always sign it Anthony. I was going through a thing where I've never liked my real name. And that's why I don't use my real name. That's why Kaki doesn't call me by my real name. Never liked it. And, um... I did it once when he pissed me off. Yeah, she did it once and I'm like, eh... Don't do that. Don't do that. Lady K and Gentleman J. <laughs> Gentleman J, I like. Katarina. You know what's funny, Trish? My grandmother used to call me that. Katarina. I like that name. My grandmother used to call me that because that's a German version of my name. Katarina or Katrina. I like Katarina. We got pizza. We got pizza and chips and garlic knots. But oh, Chooch, you're going to bed already? He's got a baby. I know. And cheesy garlic now. Good night, Chooch. Thank you for Good stopping night, buddy. in. Jamie's pickup line. Why can I not see tonight? How's it, How's it going? The name is Tony? I Tony missed it. spelled backwards. Why not? How you doing? <laughs> Tony, huh? That's short for Anthony. You'll change your name to Dix. You know what's funny is I'm like I I've been legally talking about me in a good way. They can say I mean I think, love Dick. He's great. When my kids go to school. They can their teacher can say what's your dad's name and they can say Dick. <laughs> Here's the thing, like I'm not even playing around to you. Like Probably changing my shit. name legally is something I've been debating on doing. I know you have. For, for a, very, wa a like very long time. Eight years? At eight least. years? At least. At least eight years. Will I change it to Jamie? Maybe. Will I change it to Michael? I don't know. Will I change it to Lucas? Am Michael I Jamie. Who knows? Jamie Michael. Guess we'll find out. We'll see. Tony Guns? Tony Guns have got no bullets. Chooch. I'm not Chooch. Chooch went to bed. Mm -hmm. Jimmy Jam, did you, have you always liked Dwayne? 
Dwayne. Dwayne. Yeah. That makes me think of The Rock. Uh, that's who I think of. That's the only Dwayne I know. I knew a Dwayne in school. Short little nerdy kid. You changed it to Ronald. No. Ronald I don't like that name. Or Mario. <laughs> hey Mario, Luigi? Who would be your Luigi? Because that would be Princess Toadstool. Princess Toadstool is the girl, the blonde girl. Mm -hmm. The only princess. The... I'm fucking bad when it comes to that shit. Who would be my Luigi? Hi, Lucas. Hi, Lucas. And here's the thing. If I did change my, my legal name to Lucas, would Lucas become a um, junior? No. You would just be called, you would just be Lucas, both of us? Yeah, you would make it weird. I wouldn't do Lucas. I wouldn't do Lucas. I, I think I might do Michael. I actually think I might do Michael. I might do Jamie, I don't know. I don't know yet. How hard is it to do that? Does anybody know anything about Jamie, legally been, changing your name? I've been here. It's only right that I shake it for the gram one more time. <laughs> hey, wait, what? <coughs> on, Papa Bob. Bear said, it's been forever since I've been in here. It's only right that I ask you if you shake it for the gram one more time. You have to shake for the gram. All right, for you, Papa Just Bear. Just for you, Papa Bear, he's got to shake for the gram. I'll give you a up-close and personal titty shake just for you. <laughs> Is a man supposed to shake his boobies that well? You should have seen when they actually had boobies. Yeah. Big old cow titties. Big old, as Jamie big old cow titties. <laughs> they would move. If hey, Papa Bear. Khaki, I post yesterday told her Isabella looks just like her abuela, Julio's mama. <laughs> <laughs> Isabella is Khaki's twin, yes. Papa Bear, have you been watching both NXT and AEW? In your opinion, what is the better show? It's funny that you say that, Jimmy Jam, because she does look exactly like my grandmother. Jimmy Jam doesn't. Has Jimmy Jam seen your grandmother? Or no. Or are you just saying that? Okay. But I actually found a picture of my grandmother when she was about five or six. And NXT? It's crazy how much she looks like her. I'll send it to you, Jimmy. I'll be honest with you. I have not watched a full episode of NXT. I've, I've been watching um, the full... Or the only Julio. time I switch over is when the... Uh, when the chicks come on. <laughs> In AEW. <laughs> That's the thing. I mean, I don't know. I think it's the whole look of NXT. I think they need to do something about the look. Like, maybe bring... Considering it's similar, I would... If I was WWE, I would do, like, the old... The original Shotgun Saturday Night thing where they wrestle in bars. It'll bring it even closer to home as being indie, you know, wrestling look. I will tell Jimmy that one. Hold on. I'm scrolling back to it. That's my opinion. <clears throat> like, literally bars. Jimmy said, or Julio when Isabella's... He said, or Julio, so when Isabella... When Isabella Day, my father's name is Julio. She can finally claim her as yours. Definitely send me that. That is something I have, I have not seen in a very long time. TNA? Holy mm -hmm. shit. What a fall. And I feel bad. I really do. I feel fucking bad. I saw some clips that I couldn't believe that that's what TNA is now. Could not believe it. Really? The look... The camera quality. I don't even know who's in charge. I don't even get it on TV. I think they're on um, 
Uh, not Verizon. Is it Verizon? Direct TV. They have some good ma- No, no, no. I believe, like, I know the talent they have. And I know the talent they have is very good. But the storylines, the acting, the the look, the look of the product. If you put a product on TV that does not look like what everything else is, and everything else looks professional, like I like a lot of the guys in TNA, but I think I'm putting out mediocre work. The the, the look of the show itself. There's like indie companies that have better looking shows than that. Really, they it's that bad. They just lost a lot of fan. They just lost a lot of. Yeah, no, Kagi, I'll show you a clip after. Remind me. Yeah, I know Jimmy Jam agreed with Papa Bear because he said NXT was a lot better. I think I'm liking um, AEW because it's something different. It's something you know. I think I watch AEW because like you don't know who the fuck is gonna show up. And they both do the the picture to picture, so it's not like you could do the flipping back commercial commercial, which I do. Like I said, when it's a chick match, and I don't, you know, necessarily enjoy what I'm watching. They're dropping the ball on him. Kenny Omega should be the champ in AEW. I think it'll happen, uh, Jimmy Jam, but I also think Chris Jericho is the hottest act in, in pro wrestling right now. And I think what they're doing with him is right. I love Chris Jericho. Yeah. No, I think what they're doing with uh, Jericho is right. For a new company... To be on a station like you know, you know TNT um, or TNN. What is it? TNN. TNN. Turner. Yeah, Turner's thing. Yeah. I think it's very smart and very. And I'm happy as fuck they didn't give Cody the belt. I will say that I think Adam Adam uh, Adam Page will be the champion before uh, Kenny Omega. I think Jericho is going to hold the title for at least a year. At least a year or whenever Fozzie's gearing up to go back on tour. He could be in the hot act. He's good, but he should be the main guy. Wait, 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 wait who are we talking about? They're dropping the ball on him. Internationally known, but... no. He's good, but he should be the main guy. Adam Page is really good. I like him as well. Well, I think he's going to get it before. I think he's going to get it before Kenny Omega. And I like Kenny Omega as an in-ring wrestler. I do. But I think they're 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 doing the right thing with Jericho. My opinion. Just my opinion. Trust me, if you hear if you would hear some of the guys that come out of my mouth that I think should be, you know, top guys in, you know, WWE, you might be second guessing yourself, Jamie, do you even know what the fuck you're talking about? Kaki, you get to chime in. You don't. You don't have to talk about only wrestling. Well, that's what you're talking about is wrestling. So, I yeah, know but nothing you bring... about that. You do a little bit. A little bit. I'm not gonna go say anything because I don't know shit about AEW. Yeah, but you could talk about something else. Like, did anybody see the voice tonight? I didn't watch anything tonight. Yeah, it's true. I watched SmackDown. I watched. I fast forward through SmackDown. I should say. I watched part of Long Lost Family before I shut it off. I watched like maybe 20 minutes of it. Is Teresa Caputo in there? That's Long Island Medium. I saw her talking to some guy in jail. <laughs> mm-hmm. She goes to the Riverhead Jail. For what though? To talk to people. These knots are good. I didn't watch that episode though. Okay. That's a new episode. I missed it. I caught that tail end of it when I clicked on Long Lost Family. I think tomorrow I'm going to do Pizza Hut. Well, I have a 50% off coupon. Jimmy Jim, who are you talking to, Trish? I'm guessing you're talking to Trish. Uh-huh. Yeah, I saw you guys in uh, in Frank's live. Oh, yeah. I saw I you guys. I know both in Frank's live, guys. We were there, too. She's your fiance, Jimmy J. What? Mm-hmm. What's Christina know about that? Christina's gonna smack him if she decides to watch this with Jimmy Jam tomorrow. 
but at least Jimmy Jam is here now. Oh, I'm He's sure like, Christina knows all about it already. She's probably laughing her ass off. Jimmy Jam's like, all right, looks like she's not going to watch the stream well. I can't see Jimmy Jam being very sneaky. Mm -mm. I don't think Jimmy Jam is a sneaky kind of guy. He's definitely not. Hello. She don't scare me. <laughs> she may yield a knife, Jimmy. You never know. Do we ban or bang? Do we bang? Yes, we bang tonight. Just not after. Just not after. We did it like Always before. an hour ago. An hour ago. When we were young and fat, we used to bang after we ate. Yeah, and I was always like, ugh. Mm hmm I was never into that. We also were not eating as much food. No, agreed. We were not. But, I don't know. After I eat, I'm just kind of like, leave me alone. It's funny because, like, I think, want to hibernate. I think about, yeah, I think about, like, if we were just to say, let's forget that the Blake diet ever happened. Let's forget that I started eating at 11 o'clock, 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock in the morning at night. Mm -hmm. Let's look at our, what we used to do. We used to sit down traditionally as me and Kathy and eat our dinner together. Yeah, it was like 6, 7 o'clock at night. 7 o'clock at night. Was it a big plate? No. But I had seconds. We had more than one plate. No. Ban. I figured you ban. Who would want the fuck? Who wouldn't want to fuck this Adonis? Well, thank you. I don't think I've ever been called an Adonis, but... What the hell does that mean? An Adonis? Yeah, what does that mean? Adonis is a compliment. Okay, what does that mean? It's a, it's like some kind of, I think, Greek Greek god. I'm not Greek, though. Adonis. Can you explain what Adonis is for anybody? I, it's a compliment. Are you sure they meant you or me? Adonis is a male. My old tag team partner, Dan Dynasty, used to be called, he wanted to be called, the Hazel-Eyed Adonis. Jamie got it right. I got it right. Uh, I'm wondering. I don't even know. What is it? The one last night, you cussing at one another? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we got a little, little argument going on last night. Who? You and Jimmy Jim? Me, you. About what? The flower thing. Oh, yeah, fuck the flowers. I thought about buying khaki flowers to fucking make the internet happy, but then I decided, you know what? Yeah, I guess what? I didn't win. There's well, still no flowers. I'll just no wait flowers. for somebody else to buy me flowers. She's not fucking around either. Um, by somebody else, I mean Isabella. Because she's been telling me, Mommy, I want to buy you flowers because I know how much you love me flowers. And you bring me flowers. Yeah. Well, we ha here's the thing. We bang when the kids are sleeping. And we don't want to bang. We don't want to wake the kids up. So I don't bang her into dust. When we're at hotels, no. yes. We, yes. It's a, it's a no holds barred. It's a free, free for all. But usually when it's home, it's slow and, and steady. You would think I'm 65 years old. Just getting a new hip. <laughs> <laughs> Anytime I can make Kaki laugh, that makes me happy. <laughs> Whether you're laughing or not, I make Kaki laugh, I'm happy. <laughs> 75 years old with a new hip. You gotta love some of the things I think of. Seriously. But that's the truth. <laughs> listen, being serious. I'm listening. Jamie, listen for a moment. I'm listening, Jimmy Jam, but I can't just be quiet. I have to talk some. We all know Jamie can't be quiet. I can't be quiet he's for the YouTube. Run, he's gonna run his mouth all the time. Listen, I talk so much. I talk so much because of YouTube. No, you've always talked a lot before even YouTube. Uh, Kaki, if I were talk to talk a lot, even when the camera's not rolling. If we were just to sit here and eat, YouTube doesn't get to read comments, so they're not entertained. There has to be some sort of entertainment. I mean, that? That's why I talk so much. That's why I don't like silence. I'm right about that. 
No, I got this pizza from a local pizzeria. It's my favorite pizza pizzeria. It's very good. How many pizza slices did you have, too? Two. I don't know how much I'm going to eat them. I definitely like the garlic knots. You want to read that for me, Kaki? It's a lot, and I'm going to miss it. You need to do something this year. Valentine's Day, you have to buy Kaki flowers. But just as important as being serious, buy Isabella some. Show how a lady should be treated. It's her first. Jimmy Jam, you are 100% right. Well, Isabella will definitely be getting flowers. Yeah, I know. I won't. Kaki like looks like shit. my Aunt Liz. I saw the... I saw her do cocaine as a child, and we got arrested for stripping naked and what? screaming at Jesus. First time I ever saw it. Wow. I look like who? His Aunt Liz. Yeah, no. You never don't know done. what his Aunt Liz looks like. Okay, right first of like... all, I've never done cocaine a day in my life. I've done cocaine. I liked it. I've smoked some marijuana. I don't do it no more, though. And that's about it. Never done anything more than that. I can't put shit in my nose. I can't even, like, snort saline. Kagi, you know I love you, right? Yeah. Honestly, you know I love you, right? If I were to go out and buy you flowers tomorrow or next week, it would I would be doing it for the internet. I would be doing it to try to make it seem like... It okay, wouldn't... he's talking about Valentine's Day. That's not until, like, right before my birthday. I understand that. And don't do it for the internet. Do it for me. Exactly. When I buy you flowers, I'll buy you flowers for me. If I were to go out and buy you flowers... Like now, it would be like I'm trying to prove a point. To like, prove, yes. No, I understand. That's why I'm definitely not going to. I'll continue to buy her brownies. And I will accept those brownies. <laughs> and I may hold a... them like a bouquet of flowers. You can buy me. Do you know what you can get me instead of flowers? A bouquet of brownies. Like, you know how they have edible arrangements? Mm -hmm. You can stick brownies on sticks and put them in a thing and wrap them in a... Like cake bops? <laughs> yes. You want cake bops? No, I don't want fucking cake bops. I want brownies on a fucking stick made to look like fucking flowers. That's what I want. I'm gonna get Fuck you your cake, cake pops. pops. You buy me cake pops, I'm gonna shove them up your ass. I'm gonna get you cake pops. Jimmy just wants something shoved up his ass. <laughs> These dogs are fucking banging. They really are good. Oh my god. What are we talking Fuck about? buying flowers for a moment. I just, if Jamie gave me an elbow arrangement just of brownies. In the I cake would, pot form, sure. No. That's how they would come. No, no, no. You can get brownies on a fucking stick. Yes, you can. You'd rather have them in, bowl, no, in I, bowls. No, I don't want them in bowls because I know that's how you like things in bowls, but I don't. <laughs> <laughs> Not me. You know what? My brother's girlfriend made some really good chocolate covered strawberries. Mm. Really good one. She got khaki in for Mother's Day a couple years ago. Last year. Last year. Was it and the year before. Mother's Day is in what? June? May. May. Two years in a row. Bad air strawberries. She did do it two years in a row. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's what I meant. A couple years ago, the first time I remember having it. Because I don't... I kind of want to see our stream from last year. Like this time last year. <laughs> I'm getting full. I'm going to finish this pizza, have one more garlic knot. And then give her a garden she wants. The blossom in spring. And get her that garden. Yes. But who's maintaining that garden, Jimmy? We don't have a backyard. I mean, we have a backyard, but it's not our backyard. No. And you know what? Jimmy's mom, like, does take care of all of the flowers. She, but like, when it comes to the front and the back. No, she kills him still. No. She finds a way to kill him. Well, I thought that I killed the one plant when they went away. But I was... I was cautious on watering everything because like, I know how she, protective she is of her plants. And there was this one plant back by the barbecue. And I'm just like, looking at it. I'm like, it looks like it's half dead. This is when they went away last summer. 
I'm like, it looks like it's half dead. So I go out there and I'm like, the whole pot's just like full of water. Nobody drills holes through the bottom of the pot. They so died, I'm like, right? oh, they died. Oh, they died a horrible death. They drowned. They drowned. <laughs> they drowned, but it wasn't my fault. No. It wasn't my fault because I kept everything else alive <laughs> they were gone. So at least I did something right. So I know I don't have a black thumb, so I know I can at least keep, you know, plants alive. I mean, I can keep children alive. Why can't I keep plants alive? Why would you want... Like, I remember when me and Kagi had our own... We had many places. And one of our places, we had a lot of plants. But they were fake. Mm -hmm. Remember that? When I had all my beer shit. Yeah, it was like overkill. It was big time overkill. About the beer stuff? Yeah. Big time overkill. It was a cozy apartment, though. Mm -mm. It was cluttered as shit. That's how I like it. Yeah, no, I don't. I like a house. Uh, well, I did not so much anymore. Cluttered and then subtle lights everywhere. You know? Mhm. Mm I used to not like open spaces. Oh my god! You would just you see a space and be like, I need to fill it with something. I'm just not. Yeah, I'd buy a chair or. Uh, like a, uh, it would make me crazy, like a shelf. See, now I like an open space. So now I do too. Always like an open space, and then you like to clutter shit up. It just makes me nuts. Yeah. So there's two pieces of pizza left. Pizza was very good tonight. Pizza was really good tonight. It was good last weekend too, but I just didn't cook it long enough. What's your favorite flowers, Trish? Let's push for Jimmy Jim. My favorite flowers, Jimmy? No. Even though you didn't ask me, I'm going to tell you anyway. Gerber daisies. And goober daisies. Gerber daisies. You said goober. Gerber daisies. Yeah, but you said goober. No, gerber daisies. There's no goober. such thing as goober daisies. But you said goober. I'm pretty sure I said gerber daisies. No. Trisha, Gerber daisies. Gerber daisies are awesome. Especially the neon colors. Those are beautiful. Would you like to know what my favorite flower is? Huh? Do you know, Kagi? Gerber daisies. Jimmy Jimmy, you never heard of Gerber daisies? They're the really, really bright colored daisies. And they're, oh my god, they're so pretty. I'm not a flower guy. I'm not a flower guy. You done? Mm hmm I'm done, too. All right. We are going to pizza. bed. Pizza. <laughs> Jimmy Jim said your favorite flower is pizza. If pizza was a flower, I would say yes, it is. But we are going to bed. Jimmy Jim, look up Gerber daisies, and you'll see. I have to get up in <coughs> three hours. And three eat hours? Yeah. I have to get up in three hours and go to work. Kathy's going to get up and see me sitting right there, watching wrestling, dipping mm -hmm. cookies in milk. Normally, on a, on a Saturday morning, Jimmy's cookies are still <sighs> sitting there completely intact when I go to work. Like, he didn't even get up yet. It all depends on what time you get to sleep. Like, it's still early enough where I, I would get up at a normal time. But we'll see you guys tomorrow. Will it be pizza night, too? I want to say no, but it probably will be. Maybe Pizza Hut, though. Oh, I'm not eating Pizza Hut, but... Good night, guys.